In order to account for expenses and unpaid lunch breaks, it's often best to do this when preparing your rotor. Remember that when you create a shift, any shift that you add new will copy the specifics that you set within it. Once you've created your shift or shifts, you can select them. Then in the navigation panel, you can attribute expenses to that shift simply by typing in the value of the appropriate expense. You can also determine the number of hours payable to the staff member on the shift here, and you can adjust how much they are paid at rates 1 and 2 if you need to. But remember, this also affects the number of hours that you will export to zero for billing, but not the rate that you bill. For more information on setting up billing rates, click this link here. And that is how you attribute expenses and account for unpaid breaks. Simply add shift to replicate what you've done and set up the rotor for the rest of the week.